Hey everybody, we are in Defiance, Ohio, and we're here for the Lilac Festival, and it's going to be an amazing day. Hey, there are vendors all over the place. Kristen and I are going to go and hang out. We're going to look around. I hear there's rumors that there's ice cream, and you know what that means. Kristen's going to want some ice cream, so we're going to definitely, definitely get some ice cream. Come hang out with us here in Defiance, Ohio at the Lilac Festival. Let's go. Festival, and we were walking by a booth. And of course, both Kristen and I love jewelry. So tell us a little bit about how you came up with the idea. It's it's is it casing? How do you? Yep. Tell so us. So I will take the end of a casing and um, slice the end off and embellish it on pieces of jewelry. Whether it's so ring cool. or bracelets, there's necklaces. So you're reusing yep. a product that has already been spent. Yep. So it's recycling. I recycle. I, I recycle okay. once fired bullets. Yes. That I is do. so cool. It and is. And you do all kinds cool. of stuff. You got. I you've do. Got butterflies and all kinds of neat stuff. Hey, yep. if somebody wants to get a hold of you, is there a way yep. to get a hold of you? You can find me on Facebook um, under Cozy Mittens. Cozy I'm, Mittens. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> Either a nickname or... No, Cozy Mittens. It was a business I started 15 years ago, and I've just expanded. Okay. And so... Do you have mittens still? I do, but I don't bring them out until August. <laughs> well, yeah, you wouldn't want to do it right now. This time of year, it's not ready for mittens. Right, yet. right. No. So, Cozy Mittens with a K. With a and K. you can find me on Facebook, or I have my own website. Which is? Uh, CozyMittens.com. CozyMittens.com. It's sold out. Sold out. Sold out. Sold, sold out. out.
Hey, Kristen and I are down here at the Lilac Festival in Defiance, Ohio. And you know what? I'm really surprised. This is a lot bigger than we even imagined. We've been walking up and down so far. We're going to hit some more stuff. And what's your favorite thing so far? Uh, besides the ice cream? Besides the ice cream. I don't know. I think one of my favorite things was the Defiance Historical Homes Society. Yes. When they were telling us they have some, some uh, note cards and they have uh, a print. That a local artist, I believe, she said, Drew. Yes. So it was really, really super neat. And then, of course, the lady with the jewelry that was all recycled from bullets. And uh, how about those entrepreneurs? You know yes. I'm going to love entrepreneurs and their kids, just like me. They're selling candy. Of course, the way they're doing it is a lot more mm, above board than what I did <laughs> when I was in school. But we're not going to talk about that. But it's been so fun, and hey, let's walk around a little bit more. That's it. So you were looking for a stress reliever. How did you come up with the idea of candles? I found it on YouTube. I was scrolling through YouTube one day and there was a video of a lady that started a candle business in the Seattle area. So I started watching it and I said, that looks pretty neat. So I ordered a little kit. As of, as of just about two years ago, this woman lured me here to the beautiful city of Defiance from Seattle. So if you want to support a local business, go to, uh, I can't find your, your, uh, uh, sorry. Sorry. Feel the burn hot sauce .com. Feel the burn hot sauce .com.